Let me show you one of my favorite AI tools that I use every day that turns a video into a text document and then you just edit the text document, remove anything you don't want and it will make the edits in the actual video and then you could go ahead and export the video once all the editing is done and he has a ton of other AI tools that makes editing twice or three times faster than before I started using it. This app is called Descript. I'll put a link in the description and you can go ahead and sign up for free. The free version lets you edit text and it will make those edits in the video for you. But they have some paid upgrades that I'll point out for some of the more advanced AI options that you don't need for simple video editing, but you may wanna use them to speed up the process. I have the creator plan here, but just go ahead and sign up from this website and you could use it on their website if you want or just download the app. They have one for Mac and for PC. Now, once you go ahead and create yourself an account, I just downloaded the Descript app on my computer. All I have to do is create a new project over here and I wanna create a video project. You could do the exact same thing with audio projects also. So if you have a podcast, for example, you could drop the audio file and it will transcribe it into text and then you could edit the text, which really speeds up editing podcast too. But for video project, choose the first one. Now, this is the editing page inside of Descript and all I have to do is upload my video file over here. So I could go ahead and drag and drop a clip here. Okay, I have this long video clip of me talking. I'm gonna go ahead and open it over here. I'll let this upload. Now, what's happening in the background is while the video is being uploaded, is automatically using AI transcribing it into text. So it's gonna show me the text in a second and it's gonna show me the preview of the video. So I'll let this finish up. It usually just takes a few seconds to a couple minutes depending on the size of your video file. Okay, the transcription is done. So if you look on the left side here, this is all the text from the video and then you're gonna see a little preview of the video on this side as well. I'm just gonna put it on mute right now and if I just start in the very beginning and if I press play, this will follow along with the video. So you can see the areas where I'm paused right here where I'm not saying anything. And if I jump over here, I'm gonna press play and it plays along with the video. But right now, if I was just editing the video right now, I would have to cut out all this by watching the video, making edits in the video editor. But with this app, all I have to do is select this whole section. I could see I'm just repeating myself over here. I messed up like six different times here. For the intro, I just have to press delete. And that entire section now has been deleted. So right now, my video is gonna start right over here. And you could see the preview of it down here. And if you're coming from traditional video editing apps, you could look at the timeline down here. So you could hide the timeline if you don't wanna look at it, but this timeline is useful. These are your audio waveforms in the sections I'm talking over here. And you can, if you want, make with this blade tool right here, choosing the blade tool, make traditional edits over here just like you would with other editors. But for this video, I wanted to point out the options you have with editing text because anybody could edit text and removing any section you don't need. So any section like this pause right here, you could see there is no audio waveform down here. It's just press delete and it makes that cut for me in the actual video. So that section now has been removed. Now, if you wanna correct anything in the transcription itself, you could always do that too, because once I'm done editing this video, I also have a transcription file that I could upload alongside with my video. So for example, on YouTube, you could add what's called an SRT file. That's your caption file, and you can make sure it's been corrected. So I know this right here is wrong, so I'm gonna select it, and it's gonna let me correct it. Now, this is not gonna change how I'm saying it in the video, but this is gonna correct the actual text. So this is called Mistral Large 2. I just type that out and press correct, and it fixes my transcription. So I'm kind of doing two separate things at the same time. I'm editing the video using just text, and I'm fixing any typos in the transcription for my captions too. And this lets you add captions on the video too with some options that I'll show you here on the right side. But go through this, fix anything you see. Couple of cool AI options over here that I wanna point out. One of them, which I think requires the paid plan, but if you said something incorrectly, you could go ahead and select it. And if you press replace, I showed you how to replace with text, but you could record a new section just for that. So if it's audio, it's a little bit easier, but you could also use this overdub option, which overdub lets you train it with your own voice. So it will learn your voice 
And then whatever you type in here, it will read it in your own voice and replace the audio. This has been something I've been using for three, four years now. It came out way before AI really went mainstream. So this is an incredible option called Overdub. Some other AI option right here, there's a whole tool called Underlord. This does require the paid upgrade too, but it could do a ton of different things. For example, it could remove filler words with one click. You just select that. It found 11 filler words and I could just click to remove all of them in one click. There's another option called remove retakes. So as you saw in the beginning, I said the same thing like four or five times to get it right. I could select that. It's going to go ahead and find any retakes here. If I press submit, it takes a second and then I could remove all the retakes in one clip. It just found all these retakes, apply edits to the script. I'm going to select that, accept all the deletions. Now I'm down to 14 and a half minutes. They also have this all in one option. It's called edit for clarity. This is incredible. Removes filler words, digressions, bladder, any obvious cuts, and then you could choose an intensity here. So on medium is fine. Now this goes to work, analyzing the entire document, and then you could go ahead and make any of the changes, except all deletions, and it's gonna go to work. And if you come down here, this also lets you come up with things using AI, like your YouTube description. You could just click over here, and here's a YouTube description. If I submit, it analyzes again my entire transcript, and it writes a YouTube description here with time codes that I could just copy and paste. But again, this is a paid upgrade. I did wanna point it out because this probably saves me half the time in editing after I do my rough cut editing just from the text file that I showed you in the very beginning of the project. It's a really useful tool. They have a ton of other options that I'm not gonna go through in this video, but if you go to the media tab over here, they have all kinds of different stock videos you could add on top of your video. You could use this as your entire editing platform if you're a more advanced editor and you're not just trying to edit the text to make the video and you wanna make the comprehensive video here. They have a ton of options, but I do have a dedicated video all about the script that I'll link in the description. Once you're done with your edits and you wanna export the actual video over here, just go to the publish tab over here and go to the export tab. And right over here, you could go ahead and export this as a video file. So usually what I would choose in this option is the current composition, that's your current edit. Quality, I remain on high and I just press export and this export the video to my computer. If I just press export, I'll pick a place where I wanna export it. I'll put a name over here for the video MP4 is correct and press save and it will export the video. And as I mentioned, since I fixed my transcription, if I go to the transcript tab over here, I could go ahead and download the transcript and text document. Or if I want the subtitle over here, I could choose the SRT. Again, assuming everything has been corrected here, I could export that and upload that to YouTube. And if you wanted to do captions over here as well, they do have this captions tab. With just one click, if you just click that, it applies these type of captions. So if I just press play over here, you can see what it looks like. That looks really nice. And you have a ton of different templates to choose from with captioning your video. And one more resource I wanted to show you. I have an entire platform that I've built over the last year or so called skillleap.ai. And this platform gives you access to entire courses and workflows on the top AI tools, especially when it comes to content creation. So if you wanted to learn more about AI tools like Descript, like ChatGPT, content creation tools, marketing tools, this might be a good fit. And this is an all-in-one Netflix style subscription. You get a free trial. If you like it, you stick around and you get access to all our courses and all the new ones too. We have over 20 different courses. So I'll put a link in the description if you wanna learn more about that. And I recommend watching the full Descript video here on YouTube to learn more about how Descript works beyond just the editing capabilities I showed you in this video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.